Hey folks, Nintendo here. This video is part of a base building series, creating interesting and unique base locations. All of these videos live on my base building playlist, so make sure to check that out after the video. The goal of this video is to show you exactly how to build a base in the Radio Zenith building on Chinaris. You can find this building just west of Gorka. This video is created on a vanilla server with no mods, therefore it will work on both PC and console. If you're a PC player and you're looking for a server to join to build a base of your own, check out the Nitno Daisy server. We'd love to have you as part of the community. You can find the server information in the description. More information can be found on the Nitno Discord server by clicking the link below. Keep in mind, bases can be raided. Currently, six grenades will break a fence. Try to keep realistic expectations when building. Additional layers of walls can help better protect your base. If you're concerned with losing all of your items, I suggest making an additional hidden stash in a nearby woods. This is an interesting base as it gives you access to both the ground floor and the roof. You also get a radio room that allows you to broadcast to everyone on the map. That's right, if you're on the same frequency, players with a radio turned on can hear your broadcast across the map. This base is also located in a nice middle location on the map, giving you a nice midpoint to continue roaming the world. One thing to keep in mind is you will either need to block off the ladder to the roof from the inside, or you can build fences on top of the building to deny players access to the ladder. If you want to build on the roof, you'll need to bring up logs, and in order to do that, you will need to deploy a watchtower kit, then simply build the stairs and platform of the watchtower. I just wanted to show you also, here's an example of how a player can get on the roof, just so you know that it is possible for someone to get on the roof pretty easily. Okay, to start off, we'll be placing fence kits around the inside of the building with the goal of blocking off the windows. Although the windows may look safe, windows can be a weak point and tricky enemies can often find a way to crawl through them. Go ahead and place your wooden logs with your shovel. Next, we will be building the frames and the walls for each section of the base. Each wall takes about 36 nails. Make sure you have a metal wire and pliers before you close off your exits and entrances.
After completing the walls, choose your entrance and attach a metal wire with your pliers to make the wall into a gate. Make sure to lock up the final gate with a combination lock. If you're interested in adding more fences, you can build even more on the roof and you can actually make an entire base on the roof. Alright, have fun out there and let me know if you actually managed to pull off making this base. Sometimes it can be nice to take Daisy a little less seriously and just get weird and have fun with it. If you've got any other base building ideas I should try, let me know in the comments or hop into my Discord and say hello. A link can be found in the description. If you'd like to see more Daisy videos like this, subscribe to the channel and snipe the like button. As always, have fun in Daisy. Take it easy. Peace.